But Johnny Depp, he sure is cute, though, Kev. He sure is cute. I'm here with Suma, registered dietitian, and we want to bake over the holidays with our kids. We're going to do some retro baking this Christmas. So with dates? With dates, exactly. Now, I asked you how many calories in a date. Well, you know, these are fresh dates, right? Okay. And a serving is about two fresh dates, and it's about 50 calories per date. Not bad, and it so, keeps you regular. Well, <laughs> it sure does, because dates, not, on, not only are they loaded with antioxidants, but they contain fiber, and we know what fiber Fiber does, oh, right? We fiber, do. is, fiber is good. So okay. There you go. So we're going to make a date pudding cake today. All right. I'm and into uh, this. this is a recipe actually from the 50s, and maybe our moms or our grandmothers made this very same cake, but they used canned or dried dates. Today I'm going to use fresh dates, mm. and they're Bard Valley Medjool dates, fresh from the Bard Valley region, which is the California, Arizona okay. uh, desert region. All right. So we've creamed some butter and some brown sugar. Yep. Got that done already. I'm going to take a look at this. Isn't that cute? Oh, Vanilla I love extract. That. That Isn't is that so, so nice? Sweet? that old-fashioned exactly. bottle. Exactly. So about a teaspoon. I'm just going to eyeball it. Yeah, I always eyeball too. Oops, Why not? Okay. Give it a good stir, and then we're going to add one egg at a time. Oh, one egg so at a really time. Okay, recipe, yeah. so one we'll get egg the at one. A time. You might want to switch to a whisk. Yeah, I do. Let's get up a bit. And it's such an easy recipe to do too. Get in the kitchen with your kids. That looks so good. And then here's the next egg. Okay. This is an easy peasy recipe, right? It's an right? easy peasy recipe, right? And right. what I've done here is I've cut about 10 medjool dates, pitted them. They're so easy to pit. You just take it, peel it. And and how, it. why is it watery? I've added water to you it. You did add water. Because that's the moisture that we need also for the cake, for the okay. recipe. So we're going to pour this in. Okay. Now these are fresh dates, remember that. So there's no preservative, no sulfites, no sugar added. Okay. It's got a natural sweetness that just adds yum to the recipe. Mm -hmm. So you're going to mix that in too. And then you might want to switch to a spoon and just fold that in really nicely. You have such a nice display here. I don't want to put it on the... It's okay. Don't want Great. to put on all the fluff. Okay. And now we're going to move that so everyone can see. And then we'll add some flour. Get it in there. Get it in there. All right. Is that our last ingredient? That, well, that's our last ingredient. So you're going to fold everything really nicely. Mm -hmm. And then we pour it in a bunt pan. Okay, so now, do you want to put it in the bunt pan yeah, now? Yeah, sure. Let's do that. Sorry, 350 for time's oven. Sake, I'm trying to. No problem. 350 get it all. oven for 350? about 35 to 40 minutes. Okay, where can people find this recipe? Oh, on the website bardmajool.com. They can find this recipe for the date pudding cake as well as for our date bread and date porcupine cookies, which are super fun to make in the kitchen with your kids. Great to make so with your kids. Pour that in. Oh mm -hmm. my goodness. This gracious, is what you're it looks like. Me work. <laughs> is this that is, what it looks like? This is the before, this is the after. And what you can do is you poke little holes in with a skewer yeah and then you drizzle this caramel sauce over it oh it's just amazing that is nice like bring okay. this to the, your next party too it's gonna well, look fabulous we're gonna have a party right here in the breakfast television lobby and we'll definitely say some for kev thank you suma you're welcome for more information go to bardmajool.com or breakfasttelevision.ca for all the info into you kev okay slice That's me off a great. piece of that yeah. one.